Scene script. Have you ever wondered how many species of animals exist on our planet? Imagine you're standing at the edge of an ocean, not of water, but of life itself. An ocean teeming with an estimated 8.7 million different species of animals. Yes, you heard right, 8.7 million. That's the incredible diversity of the animal kingdom we share our planet with. But what makes up this vast array of animal life? Let's dive in, shall we? The animal kingdom, in all its splendor, is generally broken down into six main classifications. These are mammals, birds, reptiles, amphibians, fish, and insects. Each of these groups is unique with its own set of characteristics and ways of life. Mammals, like us humans, are warm-blooded creatures with hair or fur. They also share the unique ability to nurse their young with milk. Birds, on the other hand, are the only animals with feathers. They lay hard-shelled eggs and most have the ability to fly. Reptiles, think of your snakes and turtles, are cold-blooded vertebrates that lay soft-shelled eggs or give birth to live young. Amphibians, such as frogs and salamanders, begin their lives in water and later transition to land, undergoing a fascinating metamorphosis. Fish, the rulers of the underwater world, breathe through gills and are covered in scales. And lastly, insects, the largest group within the animal kingdom, are small, usually winged creatures with six legs and a body divided into three parts. Each of these animal groups, with their unique traits and behaviors, contributes to the rich tapestry of life on Earth. They inhabit every corner of our planet, from the deepest oceans to the highest mountains, from the hottest deserts to the coldest tundras. So next time you see an animal, remember, it's just one of millions of species sharing this planet with us. Did you know that the blue whale is the largest animal ever to have lived, even bigger than the largest dinosaur? That's right. These majestic creatures can reach a length of up to 100 feet and weigh as much as 200 tons. Now that's a whole lot of whale. Speaking of size, have you ever heard of the bumblebee bat? This tiny creature is considered the smallest mammal in the world. It's so small, in fact, that it measures just over an inch long, roughly the size of a large bumblebee, hence its name. Now, let's talk speed. The peregrine falcon holds the record as the fastest bird and indeed the fastest animal on the planet. When hunting, these remarkable birds can reach speeds of over 240 miles per hour as they dive toward their prey. Just imagine trying to keep up with that. On the flip side, some animals are renowned for their slow pace. Take the sloth, for instance. These creatures are so slow that algae can actually grow on their fur. It's not laziness, though. Their slow movement is an adaptation to conserve energy due to their low-calorie diet. Have you ever wondered which animal lives the longest? It's the Greenland shark. These deep-sea dwellers can live for up to 500 years. Just imagine the tales they could tell. Let's not forget about the animal kingdom's master of disguise, the chameleon. These fascinating creatures can change their color to blend in with their environment, a skill that comes in handy when predators are around. And finally, let's talk about the kangaroo. This animal is famous for one unique characteristic, its mode of transportation. Kangaroos can't walk forwards or backwards. Instead, they get around by hopping, and boy, can they hop! Some kangaroos can leap up to 30 feet in a single bound. Isn't it fascinating to learn about the unique abilities and characteristics of different animals? From the tiniest bat to the largest whale, the animal kingdom is full of fascinating creatures, each with their own special traits and talents. What does a camel have in common with a cactus? It might seem like a riddle, but the answer is quite simple. Both have perfectly adapted to survive the harsh conditions of the desert. The camel, with its ability to store fat and water in its hump, can endure long journeys without food or water. Similarly, the cactus, with its thick waxy skin and spines, can conserve water and protect itself from predators. Adaptations like these are found all across the animal kingdom, a testament to nature's ingenuity. These unique characteristics aren't just random quirks, they're crucial survival tools that allow animals to thrive in their specific habitats. Consider the deep-sea anglerfish, a creature that calls the pitch-black depths of the ocean its home. To survive in this extreme environment, the anglerfish has evolved a bioluminescent lure to attract prey in the darkness. Its enormous mouth and expandable stomach allow it to consume prey up to twice its size, an adaptation that's essential when food is scarce. In contrast to the anglerfish's dark cold world, the emperor penguin braves temperatures as low as negative 76 degrees Fahrenheit in Antarctica. This incredible bird has a layer of blubber for insulation and feathers that lock together to form a waterproof coat, protecting it from the chill. From the tiniest insect in the rainforest to the largest mammal in the ocean, 
every animal has features that make it a perfect fit for its habitat. These adaptations aren't just about survival, they're about thriving, about finding a niche in the ecosystem and filling it perfectly. But it's not only about individual survival. Each animal also plays a part in maintaining the balance of its ecosystem. The predator and the prey, the pollinator and the flower, the decomposer and the fallen log, all these relationships contribute to the health and vitality of their habitats. So, the next time you marvel at a creature's unique feature, remember that it is a result of millions of years of evolution, honed to perfection by the relentless forces of nature. Every animal, no matter how big or small, plays a vital role in its ecosystem. Are you aware that more than 27,000 species of animals are currently threatened with extinction? Quite a sobering thought, isn't it? Today we delve into the myriad threats our animal friends face and the consequences these present. Let's start with habitat loss. As humans continue to expand their settlements, cut down forests for timber and clear land for agriculture, animals lose their homes. This loss of habitat is the greatest threat to wildlife, forcing creatures to adapt to new environments or, sadly, face extinction. Then we have climate change. As global temperatures rise, animals are forced to migrate to cooler regions. But not all animals can adapt to these drastic changes. Polar bears, for instance, are losing their icy habitats due to melting polar ice caps, pushing them towards extinction. Next up is pollution. From plastic waste in our oceans to toxic chemicals in our air, pollution is a silent killer. Many marine creatures, like the beautiful sea turtles, often mistake plastic debris for food, leading to fatal consequences. Similarly, air pollution affects birds, causing respiratory issues and disrupting their migration patterns. Lastly, let's talk about poaching. Despite laws and regulations, illegal hunting and trade of animal parts persist. Elephants are killed for their ivory, rhinos for their horns, and tigers for their skin and bones. This ruthless exploitation pushes many species to the brink, with some, like the northern white rhino, teetering dangerously close to extinction. Each of these threats is like a piece of a jigsaw puzzle, contributing to the larger picture of an ecosystem in peril. And it's not just about the animals. The loss of biodiversity can disrupt ecosystems, leading to a domino effect that ultimately impacts us humans too. In highlighting these issues, our aim is not to paint a picture of despair. Rather, it's to underscore the urgency of the situation. Our actions today will determine the fate of these animals, and in turn, the health of our planet. Every animal that disappears from our planet is a loss that affects us all. So let's strive to make a difference, for them and for us. What can we do to help protect the incredible diversity of life on our planet? This is a question that sparks a plethora of conservation efforts around the globe, all aimed at preserving the vast array of animal species we share our world with. Let's delve into some of these efforts. Captive breeding programs, for instance, are a powerful tool in the conservation toolbox. These programs, carried out by zoos and other conservation organizations, are designed to breed endangered species in a controlled environment. The goal is to increase their numbers safely, away from threats in the wild. A shining example is the successful breeding program for the California condor, once on the brink of extinction, but now gradually making a comeback. But what about their natural homes? Habitat restoration is another crucial aspect of conservation. This involves rehabilitating areas damaged by human activity or natural disasters, allowing animals to return to their natural environments. The reforestation efforts in the Amazon rainforest are a testament to the power of habitat restoration. Legislation also plays a significant role in animal conservation. Laws like the Endangered Species Act in the United States protect vulnerable species from harm, providing a legal shield against activities that threaten their survival. These laws can help conserve biodiversity by preventing the overexploitation of species and preserving their habitats. However, it's not just about the big initiatives. Small, local projects matter too. Community-led efforts, such as creating wildlife corridors or setting up local nature reserves, can have a significant impact. These initiatives allow animals to move safely between habitats and provide protected areas where species can thrive. Moreover, education is a cornerstone of conservation. By raising awareness about the importance of biodiversity and the threats facing animal species, we can inspire more people to take action. In the end, it's clear that animal conservation is a multifaceted effort, 
requiring the collaboration of governments, organizations, communities, and individuals alike. We all have a role to play in preserving our planet's amazing biodiversity, and every step we take, no matter how small, brings us closer to a world where every creature, from the smallest insect to the largest mammal, can thrive. Beyond their beauty and majesty, do you know how important animals are to us humans? Animals impact our lives in countless ways, both directly and indirectly. They are a key component of the food chain, providing sustenance for billions of people around the world. From the cattle that give us milk and beef to the fish that fill our oceans, rivers, and lakes, animals are a critical resource for human survival. But their contributions extend far beyond the dinner table. Many societies also rely on animals for clothing, using wool from sheep, leather from cows, and silk from silkworms to create a wide range of garments. In some regions, animals are indispensable for transportation, whether it's camels in the deserts, horses in the plains, or elephants in the jungles. Animals also hold significant symbolic value in numerous cultures and religions. They often represent strength, wisdom, or courage, and are featured prominently in myths, legends, and artistic works. This cultural significance deepens our emotional connection with animals, enriching our lives in profound ways. Furthermore, animals play a crucial role in scientific research. They help us understand fundamental biological processes, which in turn leads to the development of new medicines and treatments. For instance, the discovery of insulin, a hormone that regulates blood sugar levels, was made possible through research on dogs. Similarly, studies on fruit flies have yielded important insights into genetics and diseases like Alzheimer's and Parkinson's. Yet, the importance of animals to humans is not just about the tangible benefits they provide. They also contribute to our mental and emotional well-being. Pets, for instance, offer companionship and unconditional love, reducing stress and fostering a sense of belonging. Wildlife, on the other hand, inspires awe and wonder, reminding us of the beauty and diversity of the natural world. In essence, animals are not just co-inhabitants of our planet. They are our allies, our teachers, our companions, and our inspiration. They enrich our lives in countless ways, making our world a more vibrant, fascinating, and meaningful place. Our lives are deeply intertwined with those of animals in ways we may not always realize. So what can each of us do to help protect animals and their habitats? There are numerous ways in which we can lend a helping hand to our animal friends and their habitats. A proactive way to begin is by supporting conservation organizations. These groups are on the front lines working tirelessly to safeguard endangered species and preserve their natural habitats. By donating, volunteering, or even spreading the word about their work, you're providing much-needed assistance. Another meaningful way to contribute is by reducing waste. Every piece of plastic we use, every disposable item we toss away, has the potential to end up in the wild, affecting animals and their habitats. By practicing the three R's, reduce, reuse, recycle, we can lessen the amount of waste that ends up in our oceans, forests, and other wildlife habitats. Consider using reusable shopping bags, water bottles, and other everyday items. Composting organic waste can also reduce landfill and provide nutrient-rich soil for plants. But you don't have to venture into the wilderness or donate large sums of money to make a difference. Every one of us can help right in our own backyards. Creating wildlife-friendly gardens is a simple yet effective way to support local biodiversity. By planting native flora, you provide food and shelter for various local species. A garden pond can support everything from birds to frogs to beneficial insects. Even a simple bird feeder or a bird bath can make your garden a haven for local wildlife. Education is another powerful tool for conservation. By learning about the animals in our world, their needs and the threats they face, we can make informed decisions that benefit them. Share your knowledge with others, especially children, to inspire a new generation of animal lovers and conservationists. In the grand scheme of things, these actions might seem small, but their cumulative effect can be significant. Remember, the future of our planet's wildlife is in our hands, and every effort counts. Every action, no matter how small, can make a difference for animals. As we've seen, the animal kingdom is a vast and diverse world, full of wonder and surprises. We've journeyed through the remarkable diversity of animals, from the smallest insects to the largest mammals, each with their own unique traits and fascinating facts. We've explored their habitats, the threats they face, and the tireless efforts to conserve these precious species. We've also understood the profound connection between humans and animals. Our lives are intertwined in ways more than one could imagine. 
From the food we eat, the clothes we wear, to the air we breathe. It's a relationship of dependence and coexistence. But this relationship is under threat. Habitat destruction, climate change, and human activities are pushing many species to the brink of extinction. Yet, there's hope. With collective efforts, we can help. From small acts of kindness to large conservation projects, every action counts. Remember, every animal has its own special story to tell. Let's make sure those stories continue to be told for generations to come.